Um, we've touched on this a little bit. Um, I, I, like I said, I'm typically asking my female patients to give me, to devote four to six months to really diving deep on their lifestyle factors, doing their labs, getting everything ready for preconception. And sometimes their, their male partner will do this with them. But let's say some, a guy has no known fertility issues. We just want to maximize his chances of conceiving with his partner. What's your advice on how long before they start trying? Should he start, you know, doing the exercise and getting good quality sleep and getting dietary antioxidants to support the quality of his sperm? You, you mean relative to what? Like how long before? How long before the couple really starts trying to conceive? Like timed intercourse, they're really ready to go. Oh, I, I'd say at least three months. At, at least three months, yeah. And and the the, the point here is, it's like you, you what you're doing, all these things that are good for your fertility health, they're good for your overall health. So these guys who are, you know, we're telling these guys that like, um, you know, you're improving your hormone count, you're improving your your fertility health, but you're also doing your, your overall health, which is going to make you a more functional, better, more energetic father, right? So, you know, you want to go into fatherhood with the best foot forward. So um, these things are really killing two, three birds with two, three birds with a single stone. So um, it, we're not, you know, we're not asking you to do a lot, but a lot of uh, crazy things, but just improving your overall health is um, just good for fatherhood overall. Yeah, I talk about that all the time with preconception counseling. It's 